Hi there. Uh, my name's Trevor. I'm a member of the Arrogant Worms. And I've been uh, challenged by, uh, not one, uh, but by two different people at the same time to do the Ice Bucket Challenge. I've been challenged by Chris Patterson and also by Nerds with Guitars. Um, so I accept the challenge. Uh, hopefully this will uh, raise a little, little awareness of ALS. I, th I think my bucket challenge will be the one to kind of make it a bit of a phenomenon. I'm hoping it really catches on. Um, after a lot of debate with myself, I've decided to do the, the bucket challenge with my shirt on. Um, because uh, I, I don't want people at home to suddenly feel like their bodies are um, inadequate uh, upon viewing my um, ripe, sinewy flesh. I don't know if it could be ripe and sinewy at the same time, actually. Well, mine is. Uh, so anyway, the shirt's going to stay on. Um, it's going to get a little wet. Um, just a warning, a heads up. I, I guess you kind of expect that. So, um, yeah, it's like, it's like the world's lamest wet t-shirt contest right here. So here I am. This is the bucket. This is me. Boy, I sure hope this thing's taping. I don't want to do this twice. It is, uh, I actually have an ice bucket. I found this in the basement. I think I got it as a wedding present. First time it's ever been used. So, so thanks, Ice Bucket Challenge. Uh, I, I, yeah, it's a, for awareness for ALS, which I think is wonderful. And um, I also think it's probably helping out all of the uh, ice manufacturers, which is fantastic because um, after seeing the movie Frozen, I, I finally realized what a difficult job it is um, to make these ice cubes. Yeah, no, I'm just delaying. That's what I'm doing here. Okay, so here it is. Ready? Set. Yeah. Ah. Okay. I'll just uh, I'll just try to pretend I'm Leonardo DiCaprio at the, at the Titanic after it sinks. It's gonna be gold. Yeah, it actually is cold. Um, I guess I'm supposed to challenge people. I think most people have been challenged, but I'm going uh, right to the top. I'd like to challenge Vladimir Putin and uh, Kim Jong-un. And I'd also, I'd also like to challenge that um, Trivago guy. Uh, yeah, because I think these are all guys who, who could really use some good karma by doing a good deed for a change. Uh, maybe Santa Claus as well. I mean, Santa's a good guy. He'd have no problem, though. He's used to the cult. I guess it's only three. Well, thank you. Oh, very wet. Cold. <laughs> 